Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you've ever found yourself stuck with prototype connections in Figma that you want to get rid of, or maybe you're just streamlining your design, today's video is for you. By the end of this tutorial, you'll know exactly how to remove or delete those pesky prototyping links in Figma, keeping your projects tidy and giving you more control over your design workflow. Let's dive right in. So first things first, make sure you're logged into Figma and have your file open. For this demonstration, I've got a sample Figma file in front of me with a prototype set up. Maybe you've been experimenting with interactive flows or someone on your team added prototype connections while brainstorming. It happens, but sometimes those old prototype links can clutter your workspace or cause confusion in shared files. Now let's focus on those connections. If you look at the canvas in prototype mode, you'll see little blue lines. These are your prototyping links connecting different frames or elements. Maybe you set up a button to move to another screen or perhaps it's a fancy animation, but now you want to clear that out. Here, what you do, click on the element that has the prototype interaction. This might be a button, a frame, or even an area hotspot, whatever you originally made interactive. Take a moment and make sure you've got the right element selected because, especially in complex files, it's easy to accidentally grab the wrong object. If you ever feel lost, just zoom in and follow the blue line. It'll show you exactly where your interaction starts and ends. Once the element is selected, you'll notice in the right-hand panel under the Prototype tab, there's a list of interactions associated with this element. Here, where the magic happens, you'll see a little trash can icon or an option labeled Remove Interaction. Go ahead and click that. This completely severs the prototyping link from that element, so it'll no longer navigate, animate, or link to another part of your file. And that's it, really. The interaction is instantly removed and your design is back to being static, just how you want it. It's a super quick process once you know where to look, but I know it can be a little confusing if you're new to Figma or prototypes in general. Don't worry if it takes you a try or two to find and select the right element. A lot of designers have been there, myself included. Pro tip, if you have multiple interactions or transitions attached to one element, make sure to repeat this process for each connection you want to remove. Sometimes cleaning up your prototypes is like sweeping up a room. Take a few minutes to check every corner so nothing gets left behind. And there you have it. You've just learned how to remove, delete, or clear prototype connections in Figma. Keeping your files uncluttered not only looks better, but it also helps avoid any accidental navigation during team reviews or final exports. If you found this video helpful, please hit that like button. It really helps the channel out. Got questions or maybe a Figma trick you'd like to share? Drop a comment down below and don't forget to subscribe for more quick and easy design tutorials. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.